Hey babies, what's up my darling MVPs, how are you all doing? Welcome back to sale with Mimi Shosley Mimi, where you get the gist, as it they do waiting, as it they hurt. Of course you know there's no sleeping on the bicycle on this channel, if snooze you do what? You lose. Are you here to subscribe to this channel or are you still sitting on a fat long thing? Kindly post right there subscribe and make sure you turn on the notification bell if not tell me how do you want to get the gist brewing from the cooking pot like how do you want to get the gist i see they hearts so darlings it is another beautiful wednesday morning and we all know what wednesday is it is wcw baby woman crush wednesday to all the ladies viewing this right now to all the reasonable ladies hard-working ladies the go-getters i am crushing on you all may the good lord continue to guide and see you all through amen now let's go all right coming from reality tv this housemate diary sessions were not to miss interesting and informative who is the queen of the diary room of 2023 the top four most mentioned names in the comment section will be on our insta story for voting so we have kosi twala we have um urel we have doing solar david we have um yvonne we have mercy ak we have yaya we have ipelenga we have veni ah okay for me it should not even pass between Urel or doing you see Urel or doing in fact Urel first then doing can take it say any other one I do not think I think it's either Urel or doing Urel's diary session or more or more away <laughs> anyways tell me whom do you think should be crowned the queen of diary session 2023 amongst us housemates let me know what you think in the diary session all right I'm um, General Snow said Name one forgotten baby Niger housemate and him, he said, Henry. And then, <laughs> wow, holler. So, Lokwe said, Hello, Swag and Khalid. So, is there some housemate you think that are forgotten in those baby streets that you think? You would mention what do you think? Meanwhile, when Tolokwe mentioned Elo Swag and Khalid, trust Elo Swag to have replied. Elo Swag said, <laughs> Forgotten. But you remember the names. How dumb can you all be? Guys, you guys forgot. <laughs> this thing they touch you. You just come like this and say forgotten aspects just like that. Uh, how do you want them to feel when their mates are booing on the social streets? Anyways, I'm talking about Elo Swag. There is no Elo Swag without Shomzi. Shomzi, Shomzi. Remember how they tried to pull a stunt just for um to create clout and then it didn't work. Now they use their hand and expose themselves. Oh. Anyways, Shomzi posted and said, my her baby's baby and you all remember the rumor that is just going on around chomzi of her being pregnant the other time she posted a jpeg and they were like no this for somebody to have posted a half picture that's a sign of pregnancy i'm always bringing every gist here i shared that yesterday so i think chomzi hearing all of that um yada 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 from people she posted a full picture you know for those that said she's pregnant to see very well so is she really pregnant and guess what after she posted these pictures people still say congratulations to her on the comment section i'm like i'm not seeing this thing you guys are seeing i thought i was the only one just juliet said how do these people know chomzi is pregnant because i have zoomed tire my dear you tire me me too i did not see anything guys you saw those pictures right go back look at it again is she pregnant there all right um kanaga junior official posted and said no pressure just progress absolutely been a great time working on this project and i really can't wait for you all to eat what we have been cooking big shout out to kcast great leader yes kanaga junior we can't wait for what you're cooking for those people who have been coming for him saying he has not been doing anything then look at that he just finished a project and i have a reason why i brought kanaga junior ish here okay he also said do you have plans for christmas or we should just try again next year at least we are alive fina said let's go again next year olivia said where will they go make we they go now 
<laughs> Wahala for people who don't make money 2023, they say, let's try again next year. Who now won't deceive? Anyway, um, Olivia posted this picture. If you went for that all um, Lagos all white party where Mercy and other housemates went to on Sunday, and she posted this picture, beautiful picture of hers, and said, "God has made me that girl forever." And somebody asked her, "Which girl, babes?" And she said, "The girl you can never be." Guys, is there something wrong with that? Her reply, or you think the question the person asked was kind of dumb? And then she gave that reply that the girl you can never be because people have been coming for her regarding that reply. Like, why would you just be so? rude why did you answer like that blah 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 um dressed queen said olivia defensive mechanism gone gone wrong sis everything is not about fight you made an obscure statement and she wanted you to elaborate you all do too much and point of correction she is way much more than whatever you present yourself to be now guys i have a question do you think what that lady asked is wrong or you think what olivia said was actually right now the reason why i had to talk about kanaga junior is because of kanaga junior brother we know that kanaga junior has a an elder brother nandi kanaga sinclair amy right yes he's into movie and he posted this and said his project and said i am making this film next year in may everything that i will need to make this film will be available for me he is actually speaking into existence as you can see the tweet below he said tweet into existence and he said he now posted the project the, the front page and said everything he would need for the film meaning that everything he needed for this film is not ready but by god's grace that by may next year that everything would be ready and guess what finna pitched her interest in nito without wasting time and said boya i should be the author girl you see baby girl really wants to be working back to back come 2023 i remember her space with her fans she says is it the reason why she's carrying this osato on her head like gala is if, if it goes well people would rush her for a few you know when she said that kanaga junior brother replied and said ah fina is here baby. whatever they said uh it will she i fit afford you you know fina now said no worry i cheap <laughs> you can't afford her God will provide. Finn Nation seeing that, they started telling the guy, you can't afford her. They started putting all their mouth. She's the IT girl. You can't miss with her. Very possible. You can enter her DM. Big bro, my star girl and star boy for this. You can afford her. But you know the funny thing is, I love it that Fina actually pitched her interest on this because most times they see them as oh this um celebrities that they are too expensive because of the Levy brother show. But when you get to talk to them, you see that it's not really that expensive like they really think. They just want to create that their fame and create that their tent on that area. Fin Nation talking about Fin Nation doing too much. This is one of them. Barry said, "Now this is my sheep. Anything on our life, make on our talk. Age is just a number. Since now all of the men where they this life with the sheep with Fina, who care to join this group? <laughs> oh my word! Oh, you people should leave Fina alone. No, now single she single she no keep best. And she replied, I said, Ah, what thing be this? All right, so Mary Ebony said, Adekule village people, they follow him two times in Big Brother. <laughs> Hi, now what for people? Still nothing to write home about. Chai. Anyway, somebody replied and said, you stand messy who still can't speak fluent English. But guys, I have a question. I think people want, whenever you're all over the social space, that's when they think you're winning. Anyways, talking about Adekunle, he posted this and said, Hey guys, Techno Mobile NG wants me to tell you that for any Spark 20 series phone you purchase this period, you stand a chance to win an all expense paid trip to Cote d'Ivoire to watch the African Nation Cup. Everything about the phone screams beauty, efficiency and sleek. Hurry and get one or two now. Maybe, just maybe, it will be one perfect Christmas gift. Now, this is somebody who is busy posting his gig. Small, small. He's not making noise or anything about it. And people think, oh, his presence in Big Brother does not watch it. Um, Royal Superior said, how are they could let influence for two phone brand needs to be studied? I am telling you because it baffles me too. And then he said, I love that he's doing it with not so much noise and because he's not doing it with so much noise people think he's not doing anything he's not making money or something make calm down no um winners avenue said 
Mercy AK is queen any day. Her silence in the face of ex shenanigans need to be studied. Your faves can't relate. Now, this is bringing us to Mercy. You know, yesterday I shared with you all about Kid Wire and Erika. Yeah. So the mercenaries started coming for Erika. They said Erika actually stopped, started beefing Mercy because of Kid Wire. And I was so surprised to hear that. Hectic Reborn said she consistently supported certain people on the show. There was never a time she supported your fave, not before the kiss or after it, but for some twisted reason, you want to make it about man. Last, last, when I go like female rivalry, sure. So the mercenaries are like, this is the same lady that stopped supporting Mercy because of Kid Wire and Mercy kissed. Now, are you are you on this, Um, you follow these things back to back again? Yeah? Do you ever see um, Erika you know clamor for vote for mercy and then let her stop because it is actually staring a whole lot between fan bases you know the fan bases I mean is the mercenaries and people who do not like mercy and Erika fans you understand because Hectic Reborn I know him too he's a cross stand so I do not know if he's also Erika fans too you know so they feel like uh, him is saying that Erika did not was never voting, uh, telling people to vote for Mercy. That she had particular people she was rooting for. Guys, what do you think? Because they don't argue tire about this matter. Lamborghini said, "See this one, no. Go to her page. You will see her favorite housemates. She posted and said she's rooting for them. Anyway, let me save you the stress. Here you go. Cross, Mercy, Tolani." Pere and Kid, Dwarf and Ven Bitter wasn't part of them. But after the case, we didn't even see that she turned against Mercy. Erika supported Mercy before the kiss, though. Check her page. Are you minding those mumunaries? She strongly did in the beginning until the kiss or whatever. Now you see, like a quite number of people here said she was supporting Mercy at the beginning. Then with the kiss with Kid Wire, she now switched. Okay, she struggled did in the beginning until the case or whatever. Lord, do your investigations well, low hey, A, yeah. You are suddenly having amnesia. Now, because of man, I'm happy kid did did mod her. So they are like she carry kid matter for head up on you said these people are just friends, nothing much is there. But seeing anybody getting close to kid, you go beef the person. Um your faith girl said, Be mad at your fellow lady over that guy will forever make me laugh. Women always fighting their fellow woman because of a man that doesn't rate them. Remember the gist of the previous video. If you follow my previous video, that means you would understand where all of the where all of this is coming from, what Kid Wire said and where it, Erika's reaction and everything. She even sat with him together in an event recently, only to be mauled like this. She deserved all the modding very... She was hoping he would come out of the house and realize that she must have strong feelings for him, then marry her. That's cray cray. A very much so they were just coming for Erica like that, like that, like that. So, guys, what do you think about this? You think say Erica beef mercy because of kid? Let me know what you think in the comment section. Because for me, I'll be dropping my voice right here and now to see you guys later. In all you do, in whatever you're doing, make sure you have a great day and just make sure you always put smile on that beautiful face of yours. Bye for now, guys.